In today's adventures, I'm with my buddy Justin, which is inside Maverick right now, getting himself something to drink. We're heading back to Pull and Save to go pull that part out from my car. And I'm gonna check a few other things to see how hard it is to remove the fuel rail, as well as the thermostat from the PT Cruiser. So I, since they're junk cars, it won't really matter. But we're gonna see how hard it is to pull those. <laughs> what do you think, man? Did they take a pretty good video of you? Huh? Tastes pretty good video of you? Yeah. And I'm sure as everyone can see, I'm, we're at the nice junk graveyard. Back for a fuel reservoir with my homeboy Justin right here. He's a good guy. But we'll check with you in a bit. Well, as you can see, we actually got the brake master cylinder out. But look at that. Isn't that wick in there? Can't show you that well, sorry. Uh, look at that. That is so wicked in there. And then these lines right there with the brake fluid. And the brake master cylinder is under there. Because it was not the one we needed. The one we needed has a a drain thing on the side of it, and that one does not, it has a hose hooked into it, and so that one wouldn't work for us. So we're on the looks for another one. Well, at least my friend is actually on the look for a Dodge Journey for a mirror for his truck, but hey. You look car graveyard for as far as you can see <laughs> and there's my friend Justin but look at this you got Dodge you got every car in here me and my homeboy Justin that guy right there just got done at uh, pulling safe Although they charge a $2 admittance fee and the two pieces I got, I did get my reservoir for my brake master cylinder. This round. I did get the reservoir for my brake master cylinder, plus an additional piece for inside my car that's going to make it look sick inside. I'll show you guys I'm all done. Until then, late. As I said today, I went to the junk graveyard and I found the piece I needed as well as an additional piece. This is what the back of my car looks like right now. All trashed out, right? Well, the original piece I found, I told you, was the reservoir for brake master cylinder, which is right here. See, it has that piece right there, so I've broken off. It has a screw in it. And I put that quick drain silicone over that end of it because it still has a bit of brake fluid in it. I don't want it to leak over my car. But, as you can see, It'll sit like this. It'll sit like that. So the screw will actually go on the other side. And this way it'll hold my brake fluid. And then all that uh, silicone at the very bottom I'll take off as I go to put it on the on the old one. So I don't have to worry about any brake leaks. So that's gonna help me help me a lot. And then the other piece I got was that shelf. If you see close enough, I got a kickstand right there. <laughs> Isn't that cool? So let me let me show you what it looks like with a kickstand with it in. And this is what it looks like right now in the back of my car with that in. That's a shelf. It goes through my back seat and my back door. Some of the stuff in the bottom gets all covered up and hidden. And doesn't that look pimp? It actually belongs in this car. Isn't that nice? And like I said, it's nighttime right now. It's about, I think, almost 8 o'clock. And I got the pieces I need, and they're going to work for me. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll broadcast again to you guys next time I get a chance to do anything that might be informative. Until next time, have a great day. Bye.